2017 Topps Heritage WWE. Look for Daniel Bryan relics and autograph relics only at Walmart. I'm looking for the 87 Topps design, which is awesome. Let's see if I can pull that Alexa Bliss card. So I'm liking the Heritage ones. I bought like a bunch of Heritage recently, so just because it has the old baseball designs, but with wrestling, so. You know, this one has 87 tops, which I think is cool. One of those iconic designs. So I think Heritage is probably my favorite WWE release. Just because, of, like I said, the old designs. Oh, we got one bonus relic card inside. Ooh, let's see what it is. We'll save that one for last. We'll put it over here. I'll probably forget about it, too. All right, so we got Goldberg, Cena, and Bailey with that cake. Young Bailey. So, let's see what we got. What do they got? The 85 design, too? Oh, look at that. We got an 87 Hot Rod. Rowdy Roddy Piper. Lex Luger. Look out. Zack Ryder. Natalia needs to retire. There you go. John Cena. Oh, we got a bronze coming up. You can't. You can't see this one. An invisible card. And we got a bronze Jake the Snake. We got the old 87 design of The Undertaker. It's pretty cool. Brock Lesnar defeats Randy Orton by TKO. And Ultimate Warrior defeats Honky Tonk Man for the Intercontinental Championship. Back then when Vince just shoved the warrior down our throats. Two cool designs, 87 tops. Oh, we got the Nacho, I mean, the Macho Man, Randy Savage. You got Stone Cold, Stone Cold, Stone Cold. Oh, Future Star, so these are cool. With the 87 tops design, even though it's NXT. Tommaso Ciampa, fucking Bob Backlund. You got Mick Foley. Undertaker defeats Kama in a casket match. Stone Cold on the, the old design there, the 87. Triple H defeats The Rock. And then we got John Bradshaw Layfield defeats Undertaker. That's probably the best shape he was ever in. Usually he was fat with his big old man titties. But, you know. Even back when he was Justin Hawk Bradshaw. All right, we got The Man, Becky Lynch. The Miz. We got Andre the Giant. We'll throw him back there. Somebody will cry. There we go. You got Shamrock. You got Ron Simmons, a young Ron Simmons. There we got a bronze of Jason Jordan. Not numbered or anything. We got X Pac. We got here Roman Reigns defeats Randy Orton back when he was really shoving Roman Reigns down our throat. And we got Brock Lesnar defeats Triple H in a no DQ match. Said, I'm liking this this year though. Definitely pretty cool, so. I bought a lot of this stuff, too. I bought, like, a whole bunch of hangers and a couple of blasters. Ooh, we got Maurice. We got Heath Slater. We got Triple H. Daniel Bryan, GM. We got Goldberg. Ken Shamrock wins a Lion's Den weapons match. We got Brock Lesnar. John Cena defeats Randy Orton. Why is Randy bending over when there's no one there? I don't know. And The Rock defeats Booker T. Do you know Booker? Two plus two. Like Thomas Jefferson, sucker. Right? I probably got that wrong. I know you've seen that skit a bunch. Oh, we got Bailey. All right. And we got Future Stars, Hideo Itami. You got Charlotte Flair. Enzo Amore. Man, they really dropped the ball with those two. Well, yeah, he had some issues, but yeah, Sheamus, they were super over. You got Rhino on the bronze. Triple H. British Bulldog defeats Bret the Hitman Hart for the Intercontinental Championship. That classic match, wasn't that in like Wembley Stadium, I believe? Yeah, Wembley Stadium in London. And we got the Ultimate Warrior defeats Rick Rude. Man, Rick Rude was like night and day better than the Ultimate Warrior. I mean, not even close. Then we 
got Carmella. You got Luke Harper. Rest in peace, Luke. You got Batista. Jim Neanville Neidhart. Another one. Rest in peace. Ric Flair. Oh, what do we got here? We got a John Cena. Hustle, loyalty, respect. Wins the Elimination Chamber match. Okay. You can't see that, though. Ultimate Warrior. You got AJ Styles defeat Cena. Virgil defeats Ted DiBiase for the Million Dollar Championship. All right, you got Sting. We'll put Sting up there. I know there's a lot of Stinger fans. Jey Uso. You got Dean Ambrose. Samoa Joe Gold Cup. Cesaro. Ooh, we got a Future Stars Asuka. Mm, I guess we'll put her down here. It's not a bad one. We'll stick it right there. We got Tatanka. Diesel defeats King Mabel. And Kane defeats Rob Van Dam in a no holds barred match. Like I said, I actually, this is probably my favorite blaster so far. I pulled out of, uh, of I mean, WWE. All right, so we got our one bonus relic card. Let's see if I can get into this damn thing. Let's see what we get. Oh, we got Daniel Bryan Tribute quits the Wyatt family. And then we got Ty Dillinger. Event used Matt Relic. What the fuck? Ty Dillinger? I can't get something good. Daniel Bryan Tribute. He quits the Wyatt family. I mean, this is better than the fucking Relic. Ty Dillinger. I mean, it's a cool relic, though, with the the wood panel. I mean, oh, it's number 245 out of 99. From 11 19, Event used canvas ring mat relic. NXT TakeOver. It's a cool relic card, though. 87 tops design. All right. Let me know what you think. I'm a fan of this stuff, so I got more of it too. So, but drop some comments down. Let me know. Thanks for watching.